Hey Questers and welcome to another episode of BMF, your home for all things Oculus Quest. Today we are checking out a brand new golf game that is currently in beta called Pro Putt. It is currently just putting, not driving or any other golf mechanics, but it looks like a lot of fun. I'm excited to check it out. There is a link in the description if you want to join the beta. So go check that out and sign up for the beta so you can check out the game. Let's jack in and check out Pro Putt. All right, here we are inside of Pro Putt. I'm laughing at myself because I screwed something up. I just did this whole recording of that I, I wanted to be able to show you guys. I had some awesome putts, and I screwed up, and it didn't record properly. So I got to do it all over again. Uh, that hole right there, I got a albatross on, which I've never done before. Two putts, and it was in on a par five, which is incredible. Now I don't have the footage for it, so that sucks, but trust me, it was awesome. But let's jump in here. Remember, this is a, uh, a beta, so if there's any problems, um, then uh, that's why. Uh, that if there's any glitching or anything now this is a kind of a, a stylistic art style and Unlike Cloudlands 2, which is very minimalist. This is kind of like that But there's still more detail in this and I think that the graphics look a lot better uh, So when you're in this you can actually go into God mode or what I what I call God mode It's more like giant mode by pushing down on the analog stick You can look you can hold down um, or you can teleport around if you want and look at the hole and then if you push the uh, trigger um, then you actually can uh, get right back to the ball. And if you hold down on the grip button, you can actually see the path that you need to go to get to the ball. I don't usually do that because I just like to wing it and see what happens. But let's go ahead and hit some balls and see what happens. The mechanics of this game feel really good. I'm not a professional golfer by any stretch of the imagination, but I do enjoy actually golfing. Oh, come on. Look at that. First putt, I got an eagle. <laughs> Can't go get any better than that. Next level. All right, so, uh, ooh, I faced the wrong direction. So there's an eagle right there, but the mechanics do feel really good. I like how uh, the putting feels, and I like how the club swings. It's got really good tracking. It moves around really good. The ball feels good when you hit it. Uh, speaking of the ball, there's uh, it's kind of shadowy there right now. Uh, once you hit the trigger button, it kind of activates the ball, and you can hit it. But until then, you can kind of look around the course. You can practice swinging your, your uh, club, and then you just activate it and hit it. Now, some of these greens are a little different. Some of them remind me more of like a uh, miniature golf course type green. Uh, look, this, the water's actually moving. Um, and there's a bird up there. There's a lot of really cool things you can see in here. But anyway, some of them remind me more of a miniature golf kind of course. Uh, like you normally wouldn't have a sand trap in the middle, at least not in any of the courses I've played or seen played for the most part, a uh, sand trap in the middle of a green. Now that's possible. That is that I'm wrong because uh, I'm not a professional golfer. Uh, but that's not, not necessarily normal. There's, there's some other courses I'll show you. Now, in, in uh, this game, this is just putting. I'm going to go ahead and talk, but I'm going to putt at the same time. This game is just putting. Um, there isn't any other golfing mechanics in it. I don't know if they're planning on adding that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, my word. Did you just see that? <laughs> just banked it off of that rock for another eagle. Man, I'm on fire today. Um, and... So I'm not sure if they're planning on adding any golf other golfing mechanics in this game. I'd love it if they could add a full course with actual holes where you use drivers and, and you chip onto the green in an actual golf game. But this is a lot of fun in itself. Oh, look at the little birds. I don't even touch them. Oh, you can. Okay. Let's go to par three. I'll play this hole and I'll skip ahead to some other ones. And then we'll see if we can get to the second course. Because the beta actually includes second or two courses. There's no way I'm getting this in in one putt. I can tell you that much. The, uh, ooh, jeez. Too much, too much. Well, at least it stayed on. Um, oh, crap. The beta includes two courses. This one, and I don't remember what the other one is. I haven't played any of that one yet. Let's see if we can chip this out of here a little bit. There we go. And uh, so that's quite a bit, really, for a beta. And in the actual full version of the game, apparently what you're going to be able to do is you're going to be able to actually use coins, earn coins, and use them to... Sorry, I'm just putting here for a second. Come on. Oh, I'm on fire today. I got a birdie on this one, even. <laughs> Man, this is awesome. Um, and you're going to be able to... Well, I keep losing my train of thought here. <laughs> let's skip ahead. Uh, let's do a mini game. You're going to be able to earn coins, anyways, and you're going to be able to spend them on different things. I'm not 100% sure what you can spend that on or what you're going to be able to use them for, but you will earn coins. Let's jump into a mini game. This one's pretty fun. So in this game, I don't know why it keeps setting me facing forward. I think I screwed something up with the... I guess something screwed up. I'm supposed to turn physically, you know, but I don't have... Uh, let me just reset the... Oh, there we go. That's better. Um, this is a mini game. You have these. Uh, I think there's one mini game in each course. 
I think. I haven't played through all of it. Uh, the goal is to hit the ramp. The ramp accelerates the ball, and it goes into these, like, glowing ball or glowing hole things, and you get different points for each for each hole. Ooh, jeez, I keep screwing myself up here. All right, let's go ahead and put this in. I drove that one right out of the way, didn't I? Sorry if I seem scatterbrained today. I've uh, it's been a long morning trying to get this thing to work. I had some recording issues, and so it feels like I've been fighting all morning trying to get to get this video done. And it's early in the morning, and it's snowing outside, and I had to fix some Christmas decorations this morning that fell down. So it's been a long morning, uh, but and that one's gone. But I'm trying my best to stay on course, no pun intended, or maybe it was intended, and uh, get this this video out because I want to show you guys this because this is really cool. And it's cool that you, you can actually sign up for the beta. Uh, I'm not sure how many people they're accepting, if they're still accepting people into the beta. I imagine that they are uh, because they gave me the link to share. Um, but if you click on the link, you can sign up for the beta, and, and there's at least a chance that you'll be able to play this game. And it's a lot of fun. There's leaderboards. Uh, there's, like I said, there's two courses to play. The mechanics are really good. Oh, 50? Oh, I jumped right over it. Is that a 50? Oh, yeah, that's 50. Oh, uh, I missed that one, too. How many balls I got left? I got one shot left. Boom. I'm not sure. I don't, I don't know. Ah, crap. All right, so let's get out of that one. That was not very good. I got 100, so it's the last time I did this. All right, let's go to level select. So, um, I don't know if there's going to be like multiplayer or anything like that in this game. You know how, how what they're adding. I do know that there's going to be more courses and, like I said, coins. Uh, but so far, I'm having a lot of fun with this. Let's go back into this thing and see if I can replicate my albatross. I have a feeling I'm not going to be able to. What I did last time was I jumped it somehow over that onto that side and then putted it into the hole. In fact, I'm on the leaderboard for this level, or at least I was. So I can get get. Oops, that's not going to do what I wanted to do. Yeah, let's try it again. Alright, here we go. E no. <laughs> I gotta do this because I want to be able to try to, be able to get an albatross again, or at least show you the leaderboard. So let's at least. Oops. Ah, darn. Come on, I gotta prove to you guys I can do this. Now I'm not even hitting the ball. Well, whatever, screw it. I'm just gonna. Oh well, no, I'm not gonna do that. It's gotta be. How the heck did I do this last time? <laughs> That's not how I did it. Trust me. Maybe like that? Ha! Huh, I did it. Not like that. It wasn't as. That's not as pretty as the last time. At least I moved it over there. Alright, I got a 11 foot. Putt here. Let's see if I can at least get an eagle or a double eagle. Come on, albatross. Da. Okay. Well, should be able to do this for an eagle. There we go. Eagle. Two feet. All right. Now let's see where's the leaderboard. Why is it not showing the leaderboard here? Oh, it's behind me. Weird. Okay. There I am. Anyways, see, I got it in two. Yeah, that's proof right there. Twenty-one foot putt for two. That person's a lot better than me, but. I don't know why it's behind me. Something's something's wrong. When I set the game up, I must have done something wrong for the uh, for the positioning of where I am. But whatever. All right, let's go to par uh, that hole eight with the par four here. I've never played this one before. We'll see if we can finish off this course and then we'll unlock the next course just to see what it's like. Um, but like I said, for some reason, everything's backwards. So when I start the hole, it's putting me like this, and I got to turn it, which is why this is supposed to be in front of me, and the leaderboard would be to the side of me. I don't know what I did. I did something. I'm good at screwing things up, but I'm leaving it alone because this video is recording, and I don't feel like starting all over again <laughs> for a third time or a fourth time, actually, because I had I've had a lot of issues this morning. So please bear with me. Can't even see where that hole went, that one went. Oh, look at that! Right down here. All right. Now this is a 35 foot putt for an eagle. He lines up the shot, measuring the distance. Just pulls back, hits the ball, and totally misses. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't even close. All right, let's save this for a birdie. Seven foot birdie. Oops, turn, helps if I turn on the ball. Yeah, yeah, at least I got a birdie. Better than nothing. 
good shot yeah thanks next let's do this. this is 118 foot par four holy that's a long ways away all right time for some jumping here you ready guys and bang oh is that gonna go out of bounds yep dang all right start all over again now let's try to line this up a different direction oops what did i do i hit something that sucked <laughs> whatever i'll play it all right holy crap i shot that one so far it went out of bounds all right let's start that again sometimes i hit it too hard you know just uh don't know my own strength that's all was out of bounds that was a sand trap okay try it again there at least i didn't go out of bounds uh yes i did you no <laughs> i didn't go out of bounds fortunately very close all right let's see if i can't get this up here oh ooh, ooh, not close that was for an eagle. Now I got a 10 foot putt for a birdie. Who thinks I can make it? I don't know. Ah, oh, yes, just like that. Ooh, I unlocked the next one. Let's continue to the desert course. Cool. That's the other one. So you got a beach and a desert. Oh, this looks cool. Ah, music changes and everything. Sweet. Wow, this is a cool looking course. So, I don't know if you can see the other one. I guess not. Alright, let's start with this one. I got the, where's the mini game on this one? I can't see it anywhere. Ooh, that's up there. So, I like how they changed everything. I mean, you got different trees and everything like that. I, mean, I keep, I'm, I'm used to using two controllers, so I keep looking and I'm like, where the heck is my hand? What happened to it? Yeah, I'm not the brightest in the world. I'm the sharpest tool in the shed, as the saying goes, I suppose. Well, at least I got a few tools. Better than some people. <laughs> oh, yeah, that wasn't bad. Ooh, that's for an eagle. I like the sun effect. See, the sun, when you're, when you're not looking directly at it, it's smaller. When you look at it, it gets bigger. And it kind of flares. It just looks cool. All right. Putt. Not enough. Let's go for birdie. Sounds like I'm answering a phone call. Go for birdie. Oh, dang. Ah, so darn close. Now I gotta tap this in. Eh, at least I got a par. That wasn't, that could have been two feet. Must be the minimal distance, two feet. Next. All right, we'll play a couple more levels just so you guys can see it. Because I'm having a lot of fun. I don't know if you're having a lot of fun or not watching me, but I'm having a lot of fun playing, so I'm gonna keep going. Don't go off the side. Oh, there we go. See, this is more like a miniature golf course. It's actually what it feels more like, honestly. It feels like I'm this giant, and these are golf courses, and I'm using a putter on a giant, on a regular golf course. And that's what it feels like. Like the ball is a giant ball the size of a Volkswagen <laughs> or something. I've got a club the size of a, I don't even know. And then I'm this big giant dude playing through these full size courses. Because see, this looks like a full course to me you know so i mean that's this would be a normal full course except for this is the size of a desert uh so that's kind of what it feels like to me which isn't a bad thing it's kind of cool very unique but this is really kind of designed uh to get you into you know to help practice putting the company that makes it actually uh i believe designed this and i don't quote me on this as an actual way to to help real golfers learn uh putting better or at least get better at putting so you know the mechanics are going to be good if that's the goal which is why i mean look you could see if you look closely you can even see the line on the putter realistically you can even see the um you know the, the three lines you can see where you would normally hit uh and then the center line there where you want to try to line up the ball to hit on when you're hitting on the center of the club and it actually works really well if you hit it there on the very center it actually goes the way you want it to go and you can put spin on it and turn it not spin on it, but you can turn it, and the ball reacts pretty realistically. See? That's why I like this, because the ball reacts so much more realistic. I mean, obviously, it is a game, so you can make it do things that it's not supposed to do. If I was to take my hand instead of full swing and just smack it like that, it'd go flying off at the distance. Because that's just the way games function. 
it's very difficult to make it so that it's not going to do that. Let's put this par in. <laughs> Let's not put the par in. Let's put a bogey in. Yeah, that sucked. Yes, I know. I got it. No stars. Oh, I got to replay the level before I can move on. <sighs> All right, let's do that again. Here goes nothing. All right, it wasn't as good as last time, but it wasn't even half as good as last time. I'm not even going to get close enough to be able to get a birdie, I don't think. Come on, go down. If you can, oh, you can watch it. Sweet. I was curious if you could watch it in like God mode. I call it that. It's not. I know it's not the official name for it. All right, let's get a birdie here. You got a 14 foot putt. We'll curve in the green. Just like that, I got a birdie. That's how you do it. Not that I'm any good at this, but that's how you do it. All right, let's play one more level, and we'll just see uh, see how this one plays. Ooh, this is interesting. And then uh, I might just be done because I don't want to bore you guys with the amount of gameplay that I'm showing you. And I want you guys to be able to actually go out and sign up for the beta. And if you're watching this video, unless you're just listening to it, I suppose, and uh, then you're not signing up for the beta. And I want you to be able to try this game. Yes, I am one of those people that resets sometimes if, uh, if the ball doesn't go my way. <laughs> but that's not in a game normally. I won't do that, obviously, in a real game. Although I usually allow for like one mulligan. When I'm playing a game, sometimes a couple, if I'm playing by myself. All right, let's get a birdie here. There we go. All right, I don't really want to stop playing, so I'm going to play one more hole because I'm having fun. So I apologize if this is a long, drawn-out video and you could care less. Oh, this is a long hole. Care less about what's going on, but I'm having a good time, and uh, I'm having fun. Not Normally I will. Oh, that sucked. Let's play it, so I'm not cheating. There's my guy right there. Uh, oof, darn. All right. Yeah, I'm having fun with this, so... Oops. I don't mind continuing to play a little while. Ooh, look at that. Jumped it. The putting mechanics in this are really good. I enjoyed um, Cloudlands 2 for what it was, but this game far outplays that as far as for putting. Obviously, there's no driving in this game. But, uh, close. Darn. But, for a putting simulator, essentially what this is, it's very good. I like, I love the feel of being able to just tap the ball and it functions the right way. Haha. <laughs> what do you think? Should I? Let's test it and see. Well, let's test it and see again. See, this is where I'm talking about. If you hit it just right, if you snap it, see, it, it hops. In fact, I drove it. I can't remember if it was in this, this recording session or if it was in another one. I actually drove the ball, like, through the air like it was an actual, like I actually chipped it. Oops. No, not like that. Eh, what the heck. Let's see what happens if I can chip it from here. Ready? Time to do some chipping. Nah, screw it. Never mind. <laughs> that can work. Okay, that was awful. And that was even worse. Maybe it's time for me to give up. One more try, and then I'm going to give up. Huh. Where's the hole? Oh, it's over there. Darn, I hit it too hard. I think it's going to go over. I chipped it. You see that? Another one. All right. Time for me to give up. <laughs> All right. So there is an incredibly long gameplay video for Pro Putt on the Oculus Quest. Uh, sorry it was such a long video. I was just having so much fun. I couldn't stop and I wanted to keep playing. So I figured what the heck I might as well keep playing. If you want to play the game, check out the link in the description and sign up for the beta. They're still looking for some beta people to get in there and test out the game. So go to the link and sign up on their website. There's also more information about the game on their website. If you want to get the most out of your quest, then hit that little red button down there that says subscribe and hit that bell icon so you won't miss out on all the upcoming awesome Oculus Quest content. Thanks so much for watching and happy questing.